checking your server status and information in WHM. This demo assumes you've already logged in to WHM. Let's take a look at the Server Status section of WHM and the two options, Server Information and Service Status. Click the Service Status link. Here you will find a list of services running in your server and their status whether the services are up or whether they're failing. From the green light shown, we can see that the services here are all up and running fine. If the lights were red, failing, or yellow, about to fail, then more investigation would be needed to find out why and how to get the services back up and running. One of the more important items in this list is the server load. It is a good indication of how hard the server is being run. If the load gets much above 1.00, depending on your server configuration, it may be overloaded and should address this with your server administration. Here at the bottom of the list of services, list your hard drive partitions and how much storage space is being used by each. It is typically the slash home directory where all the hosting account files are located, so you should ensure there's lots of space available here. In this configuration, we see there is a slash backup partition set up on a separate hard drive, HDC, and is currently 33% full. Now click the Server Information link. On the Server Information page, you can see the complete details of your server. In this case, the server has an Intel Pentium 4 1.7 GHz processor with 256 kilobytes of cache. The server has 512 megabytes RAM memory. It has two hard drives named HDA and HDC. Here we can see that hard drive HDA is an 80 gigabyte drive. HDC, the second hard drive, is also an 80 gigabyte drive. You can see a breakdown of how the 512 megabytes of RAM memory is being used here. Finally, a detailed breakdown of the hard drive partitions is shown here at the bottom of the page. This is the end of the tutorial. If you ever have problems with the service you get from your server, you should return to the Server Status section to check things out. Thank you for watching our tutorial. Be sure to let us know if you have any questions.